My friend has been at Super Ego for three years and has paid off a truck early and his trailer too. His brother started there last year and he got a different driver manager. And he's doing great as well. The thing is, they both hustle very hard and get it in. The problem is, there's a lot of these people who failed at Super Ego aren't job hoppers. They are YouTubers with pages, and you see them have about five jobs in two years. And they're always playing the victim. In every six videos is a new orientation video, laugh out loud. My boy who has been at Super Ego for three years and is now using his money to buy his first house. He's killing it right now. You see a lot of clowns on here trash every company they've been to. Soon, a lot of these people aren't going to have any more companies to go to because they're burning all their bridges. Oh, no, I hope I don't fall. This is exactly what I'd be talking about. Um, and I know a lot of you guys, a couple of, you know, a couple of viewers in particular, always complain to me about how I let people come on the platform and talk about their experiences with controversial company Super Eagle. Well, the people that come on here, they actually reach out to me and they want to share their experience. I always say, I always say, if a person is doing great at a company, and this is at any company, not just controversial company Super Eagle, but at any company, if they are doing great, they're doing well, they're making money, they're getting their mouths, it is no reason for them to come out and say, hey, I'm doing great. I'm flexing on this company, yada, yada, yada. I hear what you guys saying. And yes, I the invite, the invitation is to any and everybody who wants to come and share their experience with their companies on the channel, whether it's good or bad. It's just unfortunate if a a company such as controversial as super eagle is getting all of this bad press not that many people that works there that is actually winning that's actually making money that's actually getting along with their fleet managers that's actually uh doing you know the stuff that other people say that they are known to be doing and they like doing it they're not going to come and share that. They're not going to do that because just like some other YouTubers that came out there and shared their experience, even on their own page, they still got backlash from, you know, viewers of their channel. They just saying, oh, well, you're just a... Uh, you're just a glorified uh, company person. You doing this because of uh, because of the referral bonus. Um, controversial company Super Ego is paying you to do this and yada, yada, yada. So the legitimate people that's actually over there, that's making money, that's getting along with their company, they're not going to be in too much of a hurry to come out and say, well, hey, I'm making money. Hey, I'm doing great. Hey, this is what I'm doing. They're not going to be in a hurry to share their experience. Now, maybe when it's time for them to leave, maybe when it's time for them to uh, retire from controversial company Super Eagle, then maybe, just maybe, They'll decide to reach out to the recruiter call channel slash lockout man podcast show. They'll reach out to me and then they'll be like, well, here's my experience with Super Ego for the last umpteen years. They're not going to jump out. They're not going to run. 
they're not going to come out here and i know you guys be coming at me in the comment section like yo why are you talking to these people that only worked there for like two three weeks yo why are you only talking to these people that only been there hi um my name is peter parker and i would like a coffee please Okay, no problem, Peter Parker. For uh two, three months. Why are you talking to these company drivers that 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 has company driver mentalities? Because those are the ones that are reaching out and that want to share their stories. That's why. That's why. I'm not reaching out to them, they're reaching out to me. <laughs> okay. So this like I wanted to respond to this commenter right here, you know, just like he said, his boy. Well, my my question to you, sir, is who is your boy? See what I'm saying? I mean, I, I, I appreciate the comment. I appreciate whoever you're talking about that is actually winning for three years. I definitely appreciate the fact that he was able to uh, get money by his first house and you know his and his truck and trailer but who is he though you see what i'm saying this is what i'm talking about i got people that i got people like you that comes in the comment session and over here saying well i got a buddy i got a friend i got this i got that who i mean if you guys really want me to talk to these people y'all gotta give me a name your your boy is not a name i can't type in your boy to in the, any social media platforms to get his information so i can reach out to him and actually see if he's interested in coming in and 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 share his experience with controversial company super eagle that's not a name but a lot of you come at me in the comment session like this like i got a buddy i got a friend i got a brother i got a sister you know and that part right there is like bro like if y'all want me to talk to these people y'all gotta give me some type of some type of information or share the information share me out you know share me out in your social media share if you're in if you're in uh groups like myself i'm in several super ego groups share me out there because i'm sure those same people that is winning over at super ego they're in the groups they might not be commenting they might not be active in the groups but i guarantee you they see what is being said in the groups and if y'all share to say hey you know lockout men is looking for drivers of super ego that's actually winning that been there for more than a couple of years okay that's what you should do you should reach out to your people and say hey i i, I got this youtube channel you know he does a lot of conversations with uh super ego drivers and majority of them has been you know in a in a not so good light with their experience why not come on there and share your experience and let the people know that hey this is the side of super ego that the people is not seeing that's all i'm saying that's all i'm saying you know and i i i can't agree with this guy you know in the comment session i can't agree majority of these guys that has youtube pages TikTok pages and all like that you're, you're you're right about them you're right about them you know they they have one job one minute three four videos later they got another job and four five six videos later they're at another uh they're at another job so i i agree with you sir but my thing is this if you're gonna share what your boy you're just a miserable dick now you're mean to everybody and FYI, it's called a venti because it's 20 ounces. 20, venti. Is doing over at Super Ego for the last three years. Give me some light on who he is 
and share the fact that, you know, we're here. That's all. That's all I got to say. I don't have a dog in this fight. I don't. I don't have a dog in this fight. I mean, me personally, like my personal uh, feelings about Super Ego, I don't have none. I don't work for the company. <laughs> Will I work for the company? No. You know, because I did my own research. I did my own uh, reviews. I did my own uh, things to find out about the company. So will I ever work for Super Ego? No. <laughs> but do I have, do, do I, do I don't like Super Ego? No, I never worked there. So I can't, I can't give you my experience. I never worked for the company. So I can't say, hey, I hate Super Ego and yada, yada, yada. I can't do that because I did not work for the company. That's why I give my platform to the people that has worked for the company, that has experience with the company. And it's, I, I tend to agree, it is more of a negative light on the company than it is positive. But if there's positive guys out there that's that's driving for the company that's willing to share their experience i'm all for it